I like these passages describing the difference between a strong man of character and one that just gets by. A weakling, for me, I translate that as weakened character. I'm sure for them it was more physical. But my experience has been you can be physically strong, but if your character is weak, all the muscle will not help in the end. You'll just run anyway, if you think you're going to lose. SOF 10-2 It is written in the Book of Mithraim, The true man has many qualities, and among the greatest is the inclination towards his duty. A man has a duty to his soul, to his God, to those who govern, and to his household. The next few verses talks of a weak man running from battle, claiming he won because he lived to fight again. Today, men and women lack a strong character. All too often, we decide not to try, thinking it can't be done. I think that misses the point. It's not that you succeed in doing things, only that when you see something wrong, you try and make it better. Just the effort alone, if you fail, could have impact on others. True, you may gain nothing, and for many today, I think that is why we don't do anything. Look at civilian leaders who do nothing until they see an advantage. Wise leaders should always do what's best, regardless if it gets them re-elected. That's not the leadership we have today, and I'm not sure if there's any country that does have it. SOF 10-3 The weakling runs in battle and says, See, I have done my duty. I am alive. The true man stands resolute and grim. His enemies are like chaff before the wind. He is the master of life. Duty is the goddess of manhood, and she demands no mean sacrifice. SOF 10-4 The grim goddess says die, and the true man steps forward. The ranks of the everlasting lords of life open, and he takes his place among them. SOF 10-5 Duty says glory and honor will never be yours. Your miserable lot is to labor in the brick pits so that your wife and children will not go hungry. The true man faces his task with fortitude and cheerfulness. Do you agree, or... To you, is physical strength always more important than a strong character? Anyway, that's my question. <laughs>